Dear Mama, I Hate You. Of course, the title was very catching, okay? The first chapter pulled me in so deep that it was like, oh my God, I couldn't wait for the next scene. Like, I'm ready. Talk to me, talk to me, tell me. And so then you took, well, I don't want to tell the book, but then you took me down a journey remembering my life. And I'm like, how is this girl writing my story? <laughs> and it was so awesome that I had to put the book down a couple of times because I'm emotional anyway. But as I pick the book back up and I start back reading, you were so intense and so detailed that I really felt myself walking in your shoes as I was reading. And you got to a part that was very moving. I had to put the book down. <laughs> Then when I picked it back up, I couldn't put it down again until I finished. And the ending. Mm. Okay, I'm sorry. Wait a minute. <laughs> it was so amazing. I literally felt like I birthed. I had a baby. I'll just put it that way. You know, um, when I put the book down for a moment, I was like, oh, my God. I started thinking about my story and how, you know, we talked earlier and I was like, oh no, I'm not ready to write. But right after I messaged you and told you how much it was a blessing, I started writing. So yes, it, it brought the writer out of me, like the willingness to do it now and not wait. So thank you for your story. Thank you for sharing with me because it really changed my life. Aww.